While Friday the 13th is a day many people feel superstitious about, for 6th grader Cindy Medlock, who attends Broken Arrow Sequoia Middle School, it's a day she's feared for more than a week. Cindy believed those rumors and pleaded to her parents and grandmother not to send her to school. Cindy wasn't the only student to stay home today. Students at two other Broken Arrow schools did as well because of rumors officials say started on social media. Uh, mostly it's been conversations on Facebook and Twitter. It's been very much vague, vague threats about did you hear about this or I've heard about that. School officials spent the last 24 hours investigating and found no credible evidence of a threat. But as a precaution, Broken Arrow police increased their presence at the schools. And it's also the anniversary of Sandy Hook. So we were already um, prepared to be a little bit more vigilant than typically we are. School officials say, like they always do, they launched an investigation into the threats and identified the students responsible. Um, at least one of them admitted to just perpetuating uh, what they knew to be false. They say if the threat ever turned out to be real, they would notify parents and cancel classes. Cindy's grandmother calls keeping her home today the right decision.